2020 is a reform and modernization program that will be had, in fact, a very interesting discussion about how we can, in times of crisis, indeed speed up reforms. It's not a contradiction. Sometimes it is easier to make reforms in times of crisis because there is a much stronger urgency in the need to adapt to new circumstances. And this will also play a key role in improving the competitiveness of the Baltic Sea states by creating necessary conditions to ensure smart, sustainable and inclusive growth. For this reason, the European 2020 strategy is closely connected with the European Union strategy for the Baltic Sea region, which is already being implemented. I see basically four ways for that um, synergy between business and growth in our region. Firstly, the strategy can mobilize funding opportunities across borders and across sectors to tackle common challenges such as missing transport and energy links. Secondly, the strategy can also serve as a catalyst for strengthening cooperation within member states and among countries in the region. For instance, in the priority area for the internal market, we are working to remove the remaining obstacles to trade. The third benefit for business is that by presenting an integrated framework involving all relevant policy areas and countries, the strategy ensures that actions have the greatest possible effect. The form Fourth benefit is that the strategy can help channel existing funding instruments and habits of cooperation to exploit their full potential. The EU strategy for the Baltic Sea region is now in progress. The work so far shows the importance of maintaining the collaborative spirit that characterizes the development of the strategy. We need the governments, the regions, the NGOs, and not least the business sector to play their part. We need feedback from all of you on how the process can be improved. And the two strategies I've mentioned are both European Union strategies. But of course, nobody thinks that opportunities and problems stop at European Union borders. Clearly, we need to cooperate across borders with our other neighbors in the region. The most obvious framework for such cooperation is Northern Dimension, where we have not only the European Union, but also Russia, Norway, and Iceland. And the Commission is also committed to the success of the Northern Dimension and in particular the partnership in the areas of environment, transport, health and culture. In 2020 we shall have a smart Baltic region which will be not afraid to show and to take the real leadership of smart and green development in the whole Europe. And I think that the important thing with this forum, the Baltic Development Forum, is that it brings together, as you said, uh, both governments, the academia, but also business. And the responsibility of politicians in the Baltic area is to create the framework, is to create the uh, level playing field, so we promote and create the best possible uh, uh, framework for developing uh, trade, business, investments uh, within our region. So what we have to do right now is to create a kind of sort of new economy where we combine economic growth with environmental care, but also care for all the resources that we have. We have to use all this much more efficiently. I believe that it would be beneficial for the Baltic Sea region if the project could be seen as an inspiration for considering a creation of a Baltic Sea platform for innovation and research, because we need strong cooperation in this area. We call for making a strong political commitment in June European Council to create a di digital market where both public and private services can move freely in a digital space. Why a <coughs> Swedish entrepreneur cannot create company electronically in Latvia? Why we do not have a joint e-tethered system open to all companies? Why a Finnish tourist can't pay for the parking with mobile phone in Estonia. We should remove those and other such kind of barriers as quickly as possible. We have made a good commitment uh, under the Helcom. We all have uh, increased our capacity to collect oil spills, but we don't. The reality is that we don't have enough capacity collect a major accidents. The more uh, integrated we are in the Baltic region, 
the more integrated we will become also within uh, Nordic Baltic region and with our other neighbors uh, in, in the region. We are aware of the superiority of the educational systems in this, in this region. We are aware of the openness to new technologies in this region. And this is why the need to be successful on global markets makes it necessary to be successful here. This is benchmark country, and this is why I would like to be here at the Davos of the Northeast.